Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. I'm Corey Sicker, the Joker and Underwhelming. And uh, I'm just uh, redoing the ramp right here real quick so that they match up. I realized that I did not need the foundation underneath the ramp. Uh, but I think that won't work because of those. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to be working on getting this greenhouse area up and functional. It was kind of bugging me that the ramps were not lined up after I built the second one. So, yeah, we'll be uh, gathering some wood, getting uh, back on there so it's not sketchy to go to our greenhouse. And uh, maybe killing that boar if he's nosy. So yeah, we are making progress. Last episode was huge. We got the water house. We got the greenhouse. We got the sink. Uh, and we made a battery. Almost wish every episode could be like that, but um, Oh, right in the kisser. Okay. Uh, come on. There we go. Yeah, we should probably drop some of this produce off so that we can uh, take some of that food. Uh, we are going to be crafting with that here in a minute, animal parts. Um, okay. <laughs> yeah, we got lots of good stuff going on. Um, looks like I am in need of something. Oh, handily enough, I could use some protein. Like that. Drink that. A little more protein. Okay. Like we're going to be okay. Grab a log cart. We got some logs into this thing. Uh, it was very, very sketchy to walk in front of the greenhouse. So we are. Uh... Oops. Expanding that a little bit. Okay. Probably put some railings up there, try to make it look nice. Maybe we'll use half walls. I don't, I don't know. I kind of like not having a half wall around it because then with the railing, you can still see that it's a greenhouse. And I'll have to see how it looks. I could do a glass half wall, but I mean, I'd rather use those resources on my glass walls for my base. So, that looks pretty good, actually. I like how that looks with the wind turbines behind it. Oh, okay, I'm just too playing short. That makes sense now. Okay, yep, nice. Those line up now. They weren't lining up before because there was a foundation under this side. Yeah, I like that a lot, and I think we are going to keep that one too. Let's grab uh, two planks real quick. Another door. Why are you guys invading my space? You could have been with the perfectly happy life, but you had to be up in my area where I'm trying to build. Okay. That's nice. It's a little tight. 
but I do like that. So let's uh, stir up some railings. Uh, and on this side, I don't want a full one. Um, beautiful. That's like perfect. I just hear another hog. I might like me having a serious hog problem right now. Because I feel like I've killed two just recently. The axe is still growing strong, which is great. Picking up that cart, some rambunctious. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I am pretty happy with how the space is coming along. Hope you guys dig my ideas as well. It's uh. Not perfect, man, your stretch, but okay, I need one more log for that. Oh, we gotta refill the plank maker, anyways. Let's see a couple of these. just lifted up like a helicopter <laughs> okay that's pretty cool and take these and move them to where I like to have the storage and then we should probably put another two uh, I should probably name this one too uh, food these on the plank maker. So I got plenty of fuel in there. Let's go get this food on the drying rack. What time is it? 8.30 at night. We're starting to rain. Check the extractors. Yep, good thing I did. That bad boy are rolling. Okay. Bit of aluminum coming in, that's nice. Okay. Nice. Oh, and I'm not a uh, 
but it's barely overweight. Okay. I'm not. Uh, yeah, let's get this aluminum cooked off. Uh, we're going to hold on to that iron. We're going to need to get some glass rolling. Seeds are going in there. So it goes in there. Okay, let's make some more glass. Because we are going to want a massive, metric ton of it soon. We ever have any hope of uh, closing in at least the first floor on that base over there, especially because winter's coming up. And yeah, I don't know if we're going to get there this winter or how long it's going to take. It will take quite a while. It's a uh, it's a. Uh, Lofty projects, that's for sure. Cool, go in there. Make two more steel ingots or steel alloy. Okay. Start refilling the aluminum. A little bit of glass, and it's 9:47, so we're going to call it a night. Go to bed, take a little nap, and get up in the morning and eat something, and then uh, we'll be back to building. Okay. Yeah, plenty of mushrooms, though. Okay, so that means we're pretty much out on canned food right now. Uh, which means we should definitely go grab some stuff and make some. And then we'll continue making some glass. But, you know, let's see here. Okay, I thought I had some fruit. <laughs> uh, must be over here. Oh no, I don't have any watermelon. Okay, well, it looks like we need to plant some fruit. Uh, let's see. Plant two watermelon and two cantaloupe. One, one. Precious taters. That planted will turn on the water house to water it. Okay. 
another boar. Okay, that should have been enough, but we'll double check. Beautiful. Okay, so just got to make sure we turn that on every once in a while. Another... Oh, no, he's a living bird. Wow. That axe was so powerful, it killed him on the wind-up. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Oh, that's awesome, actually, right there. That's, that's good news. Okay. Very, very good news. Let's uh, drop this candle up on the floor. Okay, at least feel a little bit better now that we have uh, a couple of canned veggies going up. Uh, yeah, it appears like we need to start a separate crate for long-term food and for... Uh, yeah, let's keep that on us. Like overstocked on feathers. Okay. Got the steel ingots in there. Got the glass out. I'm gonna go grab some stone to make a bunch more glass. It's all glass. That's very nice. Making progress. I wish there was like a bulk glass crafting function. That would be really handy. I can just dump like a hundred stone in there. But man, we are. Uh, we're making it happen, that's for sure. The more the merrier. I feel like I have enough right now to probably build like another six or seven glass walls. The expensive part is the uh, lead and the iron to make the steel. Yeah, there's two steel ingots. Per wall. Kind of pricey. Okay, that's 20. That's nice. I'm going to fit two more in there, right? Okay, so that's another 20. Those are finishing. We have plenty of copper because I'm pretty sure that's what the glass walls take, right? Are yeah, two ingots, 10 screws, and eight glass. Pretty sure, yeah, we have quite a bit of copper. Two, three, four, five. Get ourselves fifty screws. Oh, we're gonna put up at least one because I feel like deserve at least one more. Uh, 
Nice. Yeah, this base is going to be a beast. So big. I've been debating on throwing up crappy wooden walls just to make it livable, but I don't know if I want to. It seems like a giant waste of uh, time cutting down all the trees to do so. It is November and fall, though, so if we don't get this thing cleared in soon, it's definitely uh, not going to be livable over here this winter. Please give us a rough idea of what this thing is going to look like. Yeah, it's going to be pretty awesome. <laughs> Beautiful. I think we'll probably have some wood over here. I don't think we're going to go glass all the way back. I'm not sure yet, though. We got a long ways. I don't know how far I have to close in before like we can have a hallway that doesn't have a door and it'll stay at temp, but. These are all things that we'll be uh, we'll be finding out as we go. That one's still got four in it. Bump our screws. Take this one back with us. And who knows? We might end up building another forge, putting another forge over there. That would be cool. Or we might move all, th all uh, both of those and put in a, sec a third one. I think we're going to want a third forge over there. I'm not 100%, but it seems like that's uh, not an awful idea. So, yeah, let's keep the glass rolling, Hickory. Got this. Uh, and yeah, as far as I'm concerned, I don't really think there's a better use of resources right now. I think, uh, I think we need to get working on this so that uh, we can start building over there. We'll have more space, a lot more room, which is really a limiting factor in this little hut because this little hut's not supposed to be lived in. It's supposed to be uh, an outpost and instead we're kind of living in it. But, you know, that happens. It's uh, We're still pretty early. We're only on day 30. Already got a pile of glass walls that have gone in. Grab all the steel already. I think so. Yeah, just making sure. Oops, not that one. Right there. I'm debating over whether that one's got some goodness in it. Let's grab that. I think we're going to move another one of these back over to iron so we get more iron. Okay, that's nice. Do this last couple of stone. And yeah, I think we're going to call it there. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for hanging out. I, of course, am Hickory the Drunken Underwhelming. I hope you're enjoying the series because I sure am having a great time. I hope you guys are enjoying the build that I'm working on and seeing what I am doing because things are about to get a little bit crazy. And uh, I hope you're all ready to join me on the, on the ride because I'm... Uh, I'm having a blast this game. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I will see you all in the next episode. Thank you guys for being here.